I'm actually a graduate of uh, the University of Sheffield. I studied civil engineering here a couple of years ago uh, and uh, I've stayed in the university helping students uh, benefit from an engineering education at Sheffield. We were doing a lot of things uh, that are quite unique to Sheffield in, both within the UK in particular. So a few years ago the faculty started up uh, two project weeks for our first year and second year students. Um, that's called the Global Engineering Challenge and Engineering You're Hired. And in those weeks, students work in interdisciplinary teams, so they learn about each other's respective engineering discipline, make more friends, and learn about different ways of working together and learning about different cultures. But the really important thing about those weeks is that we get students to think about their core skills and to reflect uh, on those skills and how to address um, any gaps in those skills. We're doing uh, lots of uh, exciting projects uh, within the faculty in order to improve our uh, facilities uh, and our estates. In the next uh, few months, we'll be having our Dan building opening which is a state-of-the-art learning and teaching centre for our uh, undergraduate students in our faculty. There'll be lots of multidisciplinary labs in there so students have much more freedom to explore um, uh, concepts taught within the lectures uh, and to explore new things. The University of Sheffield is a research-led institution, we're a member of the Russell Group and so a large proportion of our teaching activities to our undergraduate and to our postgraduate students is based around what we do our research in. So you'll talk by world leading academics, leaders in their field, that directly influences the most up-to-date teaching for you.